A statement issued by ACP David Eklu, the Director of Public Affairs, has announced the Eastern Regional Commander, DCOP Simon Afehu, is the new Director of Operations, while DCOP Christian Tete Yehonu is the new Director of Police Intelligence. The following are the changes made by the police hierarchy. And now, there is a growing concern among the public about the effectiveness of weapons used by police in fighting crime in the country. In the wake of the daredevil style of armed robbers in the country, a senior police officer has revealed to TV3 how some stations in Accra are operating with one assault rifle to fight crime. Here is a report by Komla Kluche. Police officers have, on several occasions, but armed robbers have tried to fire and it's not fire. Recently, I think in the north, a group of police officers were faced with that situation. They tried firing the guys, it's, it's, it was not firing. Okay? And these are old stock weapons. The harrowing experience revealed to TV3 by this disturbed police officer whose voice has been muffled to hide his identity. The policeman on duty at the Royal Motors in industrial area where the robbers attacked the company and bolted with an unspecified amount of money is alleged to have been unable to prevent the attack because his rifle could not fire. Robbery is reported to have increased in the last two months. A total of 89 robberies were recorded in January, 38 more than what was recorded in the same month last year. The attacks on civilians have extended to police officers, some of whom have been killed by armed attackers. Fear has gripped some police officers who have come face to face with these robbers. In Accra, I wouldn't want to put it on air or mention the name of the station, but only one, one efficient weapon. And this is a station that is talked with a lot of men. You mean that station has one single weapon? That is efficient. One. A brazen robbery attack at the North Industrial Area and a raid of Forex Bureau and mobile money vendors on Tuesday have left many in fear. What has happened? So far, we have arrested 11 people. Policeman could not fire. It depends on several factors. It depends on several factors. Either he was caught up and he could not quickly uh, react, depending on the professional ability or the instincts of the police officer or the skill, the personal skills of the police officer. The police administration says it is not oblivious of the challenges confronting the personnel. Security analysts have equally raised concerns about how the police armory is handled to meet contemporary crime. Most of the police stations that were built did not have the, the armory as a component, the way they were built. It, it came as an afterthought. So in most places you find that the armory itself is so hot, the ventilation is so poor, and the location leaves much to be desired. As these concerns arrive, these officers are however left to deal with the incessant